so in today's video we are going to find the value of k if the roots of the quadratic equation x squared minus 2x minus k is equal to 0 differ by 1 now if the roots of the equation differ by 1 it means that one root is greater than the other by 1 or one is less than the other by 1 so let's say the first root is alpha and the second root is alpha plus 1 now the sum of the roots is equal to alpha plus alpha plus 1 and alpha plus alpha plus 1 is equal to 2 alpha plus 1 now the product of the roots is going to be alpha into bracket alpha plus 1 now alpha times alpha is alpha squared and then alpha times 1 is alpha now from the equation we know that a is equal to 1 b is equal to negative 2 and c is equal to negative k now we know that the sum of roots using the coefficients is negative b over a and then we have b to be negative 2 so we have negative into bracket negative 2 divided by a which is 1 negative times negative is positive so we have positive 2 over 1 which is equal to 2 and then the product of roots is c over a now c is negative k and then a is 1 so that's negative k so we are going to equate this to 2 and then this to negative k now for the sum of roots 2 alpha plus 1 is equal to 2 so we are going to transpose 1 to the right hand side so we are going to have 2 alpha is equal to 2 minus 1 which is equal to 1 so we divide both sides of the equation by 2 and then we have alpha to be 1 over 2 now for the second one which is the product of roots that's going to be alpha squared plus alpha is equal to negative k so for the product of roots we had alpha squared plus alpha to be equal to negative k and then we had alpha to be equal to 1 over 2 so to find the value of k then we are going to have 1 over 2 r squared plus 1 over 2 is equal to negative k now 1 over 2 r squared is 1 over 4 plus 1 over 2 is equal to negative k now the LCM between 4 and 2 is 4 4 divided by 4 is 1 and then 1 times 1 is 1 4 divided by 2 is 2 and 2 times 1 is 2 so we are going to have 1 plus 2 is 3 3 over 4 is equal to negative k and then k is equal to negative 3 over 4 so the value of k is equal to negative 3 over 4 